Hello friends, welcome to my channel, a channel for learning simple coding. If you find this video to be helpful, please like, share and subscribe my channel. In this video, we are going to learn use of use router hook for navigation purpose. We are also going to learn the use of function provided by use router push replace back and forward. For understanding the use of use router, just go to the project. And here, this is my project. Here, this project is running like this. Right now, we have a linking here and all pages are working perfectly. We have also understand how to use link component and how to set active link that. Now, we are going to understand if I click on a button, then I want to go to another page. Means these are links. I'm going with the help of link to another page. But now I want to go with the help of event like click event, double click event or other kind of event on the basis of event programmatically if I want to go from one page to another page then how we can do with the help of user router that we are going to understand. For that we have this component folder under this I am creating one more folder I say my router dot tsx and i say rafce no problem and i use this here after this i say my router like this way now i do some coding here i create two button button and in button i say on click and here i want to put some function so for that i say open link function that i am going to use event handler and i say here click on product means i want to go to product first button then I create another button and here I say service. Then I go to another button. Then I say about. Like this, we want to go and this is an open link. Remember that now this is a function that we want to use or without function we can also do. So first, I show how to do with the help of function. So I create a function here. I say const open link here and I create this as an arrow function and I need to import use router. So I say import here use router and this is from the navigation. Remember that not from the router use router and I have to convert this into client component. So I say use client that is important because all hooks run under this. So we say const here and here I want to open. So first of all, I create the object of this i say const i say route equal to use router like this now suppose i want to open this link of product so i say route dot push and here i say i want to go to product remember that so this is to go and if i don't want to use function so i can pass directly here first of all i create like this arrow function i say route dot push and here i say I want to go to service like this and I can also use replace also how to use replace that I'm going to tell you use of replace also. So I say here replace and here I want to put about. So these are the function that we use here inside this. So we have on click we have route and this is the button why we have this error. Okay, this is not an arrow function. This is the arrow function. It was my mistake. And you see that we have now uh, to open this and we have a product service about these are three buttons, but they are not looking like a button because we are using here Talvin CSS. So for that, what I do, I use class name here and I convert this into button format. So I say here BG and I say here blue and this button i want to create like this and i say rounded like this and i also say padding like this so i copy this and i paste in all the buttons like this now i go there and refresh it you see buttons are working but they are close together so i need to put margin also so i say margin like this like this and i can change the color also if it looking bad one so i can say to this 300 like this way and uh, i just refresh it you see now it look like a button so i click on product you see we are going to product remember if i click on service and remember that if i click on back button then i am able to go to my back page you see i click on product click on back i am going to go back click on service i am going here back but if i click on about remember that and I click on back. You see, I am not able to go back on my home page. Why? Because in place of push, 
I am using here replace. Remember that if I do replace, that means it replaced the history of URL. Then you can't go back to the previous page. Remember that. Now uh, we have few more function also in route for that we can also use just I make a copy of this button and this button two buttons I am using here. So I give the name to first of all I save this. So these are the buttons. So last buttons are these two. So here I say uh, back and this is I say forward like this. So in place of replace I can use it like this. I say back button and in place of replace here I say forward. So under this we have these functions also back and forward. Remember that. So now go there and I just go to home. We have this back. If I click on back you see I go to previous page. Remember that if I click on forward. So I am I'm not able to go on forward because we do not have any forward page right now. You see in history. So I click on this click on this I do this you see I'm able to go to back page but I am not able to go to forward page because there is no forward page right now in the history of a browser so we can't go in forward but it is also workable like back is workable so you can see that we are able to do like this so in this use router hook we have push function we have replace function to override the url we have back function to go back to the browser and we have forward function to go forward so these are the functions that we can use under user router so whichever whichever you like to use in your application you can use i have explained each and every use of this so if you like this video please help me to subscribe my channel thank you for watching this video mm -hmm.